folks, how is everybody? I hope everybody is keeping well. So today we are going to look at the current situation between you and a particular person to see if it is your situation and you are resonating with it. And if you are, we will look a little bit more at this person. We will look and see what is going on, what their energy is towards you and um, dig a little bit deeper, uh, find out what's happening. Ooh, okay, so we have the 10 of swords uh, flipping there. So um, this isn't ending right so this is a breakup this is possibly a no contact separation usually the ten of swords is like a lot of pain right so um, it's like an overkill sort of energy so um, like one of those swords would have been enough but um, there's like ten of them so um, it can come as like a betrayal sort of energy as well we have the six of cups so this is someone from your past. So this is a past person. This person could be um, keeping some sort of like eye on you. Um, there's somebody spying here. So if you're if you're spying, you'll know you're spying. But um, if you're not spying, then you know I'm seeing a spying energy. But um, there's reminiscing here around a breakup, a past situation, some difficulty with someone. Three of oh, look at this heartbreak, pain, suffering separation for some of you there could be third party um interferences we have death ending again cycles closing out something changing very quickly and suddenly and we have the magician ten of pentacles is at the bottom so some of you were trying to manifest something significant with this person and some of you there might have been something very significant here that was you know already there with this person um, but I am seeing a huge shift and change in the situation I want to know what happened here what happened here the world the king of cups The Six of Pentacles. The Eight of Wands. And the Two of Pentacles. Okay, so for some of you here, you were dating with someone and there was a betrayal. I am seeing a potential third party. This person could have been talking to somebody else. Um, hmm. yeah, you know, there could be doubts in your mind here about whether this past person was trying to like manifest something with somebody else. Um, I am getting like a betrayal energy. It's linked to some sort of back and forth. So possibly communication or messages with that eight of wands and something else that this person or someone else that this person was giving their time and their attention and their energy to. Uh, that is for some of you. Um, for others of you here, there was a, um, an upgrade that was sort of like needed in your situation. You had got to a certain point and uh, maybe things hadn't shifted or changed. This could be around where your relationship was going. Um, was there any progress? Is there like um, commitment on the table? Has this person, you know, like an evaluation, um, but you know, some sort of like upgrade did not, um, come you know there's like separation so um this person may have feelings for you for example but um they were not committing to you they were not giving you that uh, stability it was not equal it was not balanced i am seeing this person here seems to be going back and forth currently around um, whether to send you some sort of message. Okay, they are aware that there has been great hurt here, uh, whether this was because this person brought some sort of third party into the connection um, or whether it was because this person maybe disappeared very quickly or um, like suddenly or um, just kind of like blindsided you almost in a way. Um, there's a three of swords sitting at the center of all of this and both of you are feeling it. So this person's feeling um, heartbroken at this time as well. Um, so I wanna see, we'll see a little bit more about, you know, what this person's like intending to do. Let's see. Is there intentions here or are they going to do nothing right what's okay so i do have the knight of pentacles i can see currently this person's thinking about reaching out to you so there is already in the current energy this you know, desire there to do that but they seem to be like slowing it down or tempering it this person's coming towards you very very slowly so there's a very slow energy here but i am seeing this person reaching a point um where there is like like a breakthrough moment 
page of cups, the six of wands, the hierophant, and the eight of cups, ten of wands, temperance, the page of pentacles, the queen of wands, the hanged man. Oh, look what I just seen, queen of swords with the seven of swords. You see, I'm seeing another person. So for some of you, yes, there is like a third party here. I'm seeing another person. I'm seeing a secret. I'm seeing something hidden. I'm seeing a secret, a secret person. Let's see. Yeah, look, secret. I'm getting high priestess in the past. Five of cups. Did some sort of secret come out? Did somebody find something out? Nine of wands. Five of wands. Justice. The six of cups. Magician. Seven of pentacles. The world. The four of pentacles. The five of pentacles. The ace of swords. The king of wands. And the nine of cups. So some of you are dealing with like a you know, selfish sort of person here. Like this person does tend to put themselves first. Okay, so um, I think that there's something about that that you're seeing um, in this person. Um, because like for a lot of you, I am seeing this energy where, you know, there's this like five of, of uh, pentacles energy sitting on you where, you know, there's this feeling of, you know, being like maybe abandoned or rejected or pushed away or, um, you know, like somebody else was chosen or um there's like a on the outside sort of energy and i am seeing like a lot of you sort of like carrying that almost like on yourselves but i'm seeing like this point in the future where you're like actually seeing this person as just being a selfish person right and you can't control this person's actions so instead of kind of well kind of putting it on yourself you're you're seeing this person's actions for you know what they are or what what they were um and i do see this person trying to make some sort of amends so um at this current time they're thinking about sending some sort of message um i do see some sort of message coming through um it is vindicating for you because um i think for a lot of you you are waiting for some sort of communication from someone who um hurt you or wronged you here seven of cups and temperance for some of you like a lot of time has passed and um you're no longer sure or um feeling like this person is going to do anything you know there's a, a feeling here of you know this person's completely disconnected and walked away um a lot of you are not expecting you know to hear from this person and a lot of that as well is because there is like a judgment on this person so i do see like a judgment on this person you are judging this person um and you know with good reason I would say there's some sort of secret or something that this person kept from you um, it looks like something came out or something was revealed here so um, you do uh, question this person's like uh, morals um, you're questioning their morals or um, sort of like uh, ethics their values um, even on how they sort of like you know dealt with this situation um, there's like a, a huge question mark over this person's energy the six of swords I am seeing it's difficult to you know, try to move on from this situation okay because um you know there was an intense connection here between you and this person but um i'm seeing like a special connection that you felt with this person in the past um and damage has been caused right so um it feels like there's kind of like a swirling still of like emotions around the situation um especially for this person i don't see this person being able to move on and you know it's because they've wronged you this person has wronged you and i am seeing re regret about that and i'm seeing regret about something that was hidden or something that was being kept secret or something that they were unable to tell you or reveal to you there is regret about that and this person carries it and i see this person carrying it, and they've been carrying it for a while they've been carrying it since you know whatever it was that happened here they have been carrying it um this person is feeling like they have to you know make some sort of amends they have to reach out and um, at least some sort of like offer some sort of explanation I don't think this person feels like you might be open to hearing them out. Um, there is some sort of fear here that um, you know you might be maybe angry or cross or something um, with them. Um, that maybe your mind has been made up, or um, and again, it's linking to some sort of deception or some sort of secret, something that was hidden. For some of you, this person um, lied to you about something. For some of you, this person cheated. Um, there could be some sort of third party thing, and, and then for others of you, this person stole from you. There's some sort of deception. Um, 
something that this person did you know you possibly found out about it here but um you know the whole situation is just showing as being very difficult and um, this person has been carrying this and um, they're thinking about messaging now like in the current energy so they are aware that because of some past trouble between both of you um and hurt that they have caused that it feels very much like um you know things kind of like ended very you know, quickly or something here um, and that you know it's coming from their side so there is an awareness of their own behavior and this person feels like they acted um, almost like like a joker or something like like it, when they're looking at their energy now it's almost unbelievable but um, I am seeing this um, awareness that this is not going to be easy um, and you know I see contact so I see this person sending a message we do have a six of cups in justice so this past person here seems to be coming forward with an attempt to make amends. Okay, so there is possibly some sort of like offering here of uh, an apology, an olive branch. Um, something, you know, it's not showing as aggressive or um, contentious in any sort of way. The approach seems genuine, but there is like an ulterior motive that I am seeing, you know, with this person. So this person's trying to manifest um, an energy that you guys shared in the past. So um, for some of you, this person could be trying to remind you of, um, you know, past things, um, moments and stuff. There is an ulterior motive. So what is your ulterior motive? What is it that you want? The King of Cups. So this person has, look, the lovers. This person's... A, and the nine of wands so they do want to fight for this they want to fight for this they want to fight for you for some of you there is you know a third party um that could be impacting the situation um or there's something that you're not aware of still um if this person's coming forward they need to be coming forward with like full truth right uh, clarity um and i do I see i do see you expecting this person to come forward with um that truth that clarity a plan you know all of that here with regards to um the questions that you have right the questions because like i said you have a big question mark over this person like a big question mark and even though they're fearful i do see them reaching out and um, you might want to hear this person out but um, i mean they better be coming with something really good here right that's the energy that i'm seeing uh, from you if this person's going to hold back if they're going to um, try to manipulate or um, try to manipulate with like memories and different things like that avoiding the truth about uh, maybe something that happened here in the past I don't really see you going for it um, and I do see this person they are holding something back from you so when this person comes forward here in the future um, you might feel like you're not getting the full answers or there's something about what this person's saying to you that just does not really add up um, they are holding back on some sort of truth Yeah, I mean, you feel like your you know hopes for this person are just being impacted by this like devil energy. Like they themselves are sort of showing as an obstacle in this connection. Like um, it's almost like two steps forward and then one step back with this person. This person's making some sort of attempt, but then they're not going the full way. Um, I do see you know you viewing this as an answer, pretty much um, is what I'm getting. You know, as time is going forward here. I mean. This person, you know, you're giving them a chance, you're hearing them out. But if they're not coming forward with the full truth, and I don't think you feel like they are, um, you are possibly going to turn away from this person, despite the fact there's feelings here. This person wants to um, like rebuild with you, but um, by not giving you the truth in the situation, um, you know, there's something about that that's making you feel very devalued um, and you're no longer you know there I do see this stronger energy with you in the future so um, you're not really putting up with that you know um, if this person's making you feel in any way like they made you feel in the past then you're um, you're not putting up with it um, I do see this person does not want to lose you so um, even if you turn away in the future um, I don't see this person like giving up they're telling me multiple times they will fight for you in this connection um, but when they show up it does seem to be a little bit less than you know maybe how they're feeling um there or you know they're kind of <laughs> viewing things yeah i think there's like a wee bit uh, of a difference here 
so this person may be feeling like they're saying all the right things but um you're looking at their like actions and you know um they might say all oh, this like lovely stuff to you and then not text you straight away or not text you till like two days later or whatever um and you're just like what was the point you know so um you are judging this person's energy you're judging it now you've already made some sort of judgment on this person it looks like um and they're trying to make your um you're trying to change your mind <laughs> they're trying to change your mind over the next six months but like you will be the judge of that is what i am seeing so that is what i am seeing i hope that that has helped thank you all very very much and i hope you all have lovely days thank you bye bye